All right, the next uh, exercise we're going to do is um, we're going to calculate a net transaction amount so we can determine what is um, our actual uh, revenue, not the taxes, right? What is the actual sell amount and can we reconcile it with our financial statement? So this would be a very typical uh, transaction that we would want to do in terms of analyzing our AR. Uh, how much of that is is owed to the government versus uh, to our uh, bottom line. So we're going to look at manipulating a field. We're going to be appending the data set with a virtual field and we'll be uh, changing the field name in the database, et cetera. So let's go ahead and 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 go back to our idea. Uh, I am going to just as a, I'm going to close everything and go back to accounts receivable. I want to make sure that my um criteria is deleted so i'm going to right click and say clear um and by the way i have all of these in the history if i ever want to go back and look at them but i'm going to clear them so i can see my 253 transactions from the beginning and then i'm going to go to my data um, manipulation of fields and i'm going to define an action field uh, and so i'm going to go all the way down and I will be creating a an appended uh, field that is going to be called net, and it is going to be a virtual numeric field with two decimal places. I don't need to create a length, uh, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, you leave it blank, and the description is going to be net amount. So let me just go ahead and, and type that as net amount in my description so that it can be in there. Immediately, it's going to ask me, what is that you're trying to calculate? So I'm going to start by calculating my gross amount. Minus, it really is minus my GST minus, right, minus my PSD, right? But for purposes of this exercise, it's asking us to create a parenthesis. So I will follow the same instructions as the book. And I'm going to say this is gross amount minus the addition of the taxes, right? So gross amount minus GST minus the general uh, sales tax and the provincial or the state tax as well. All right, so let me validate that and it works. Let me run it. Uh, yes, press yes. And so that should have created a field on the side. And just to make sure this is supposed to be 2018 and I could create a, a control total for that as well. Um, I could say, let's create another control total based on the, the net and see that brings us as well so this is really what is owed in, ter in terms of uh, uh, revenues but let me switch it back all right that's all that we're required to do for this notice that you just create a new calculated field and then that may be useful for other types of valuation or accuracy checks so let me print screen this and attach it to my to my assignment so that we can be on our way on our way um to this ride and then that's it i'll crop it in a minute let's go to the next one thank you